there's a few people out here fishing and if they see me catch a big catfish it'll be over with I'll never get to fish this place again hopefully they go home before the fish bites it's a uh, late winter very it's not officially spring yet and it's uh, one night before the actual full moon uh, moonrise was about 15 minutes ago now if I didn't have to work for a living I'd been out here all day today moon moonrise usually sparks a bite now I don't like a full moon once it's up but before it comes up and right on the rise can get you on some good fish so it's officially moonrise I've got a little bit of time before it actually hurts the bite because it's not visible yet once it becomes visible the bite really slows down a fish is not impossible but either way I wish I could have got here earlier I'm gonna see if I can't get something out of it though flatheads is the target fish I've got a good fanned out spread of my baits one to the right one to the middle and one way to the left if flatheads are on the move they will surely find one of them if they're really on the move they might find two or all three of them I'm gonna give it till just a little after dark maybe and then I'm out of here because I gotta work and I'm a long way from the house beta choice is fresh skipjack that I caught on the way here with flatheads when you're using cut bait the fresher the bait the better a blue cat is not impossible here but as far up this back creek as I am blue cat activity will be at a minimum I'd say this time of year now in the winter December they might be loaded in here but right now probably just gonna be flatheads channel cat I'm Catfish Dave, bank fishing, catfishing, YouTube sensation. Some people watch my videos because they find them entertaining. Some people watch my videos to learn how to catch catfish. Some people watch my videos because they're trying to steal my spots. I've got fans and I've got haters. So far, I've been out here about 30 minutes without Jack Doodley squat. One of the guys that was fishing here left that's good. I've still got three on the other side over there. I'm hoping they leave before I catch a fish. Because if they see me catch it, they'll be homesteaded at this place every day after today. They're probably over there throwing minnows and worms, fishing for crappie or whatever bite. They see me land one of these hog daddies, they're going to be catfishing from then on. Probably keep everything they catch. This place be wiped out in one summer. I truly hope I catch the biggest fish in this hole before that happens. I live up on a hill in Sevier County, Tennessee, and I'm probably the most well-known cat fisherman that lives on that hill. I'd say there's probably seven people that live up there. It's because I paid my dues, people. Just like I'm paying them now. It looks like those potential homesteaders are leaving out of here. That's good. Now I can go ahead and catch a catfish. Nice and quiet now, them people. Their mouths just never stopped running, man. I believe flatheads spook easy. Moon's been up for about an hour, but it's still not visible. Well, yeah, I guess I can see it right through the trees there. It's still not high enough to be a total hindrance. Looks like 20 minutes before pure dark. All I need is one flathead for a fishing video. I'll call it a night. I gotta work tomorrow. I done drove the miles. I done caught the bait. Now I'm gonna sit here and wait. I'm in flathead country, I will guarantee you that. No sign of any blue cat yet, no channel cat, 
not even a turtle. The longer it sits out here in flathead country, the better chance of one finding it, if they're moving. I like fishing up to the full moon for flatheads that week leading into the full moon. Now I don't like it after the moon's up, and the moon is up, but not high yet. But I do like the week itself if you can get out early enough before the moon rise. Potential still here. I have caught flatheads under a high moon, full moon. The longer these baits sit, the better chance they're going to get hit. That moon's up a lot higher than I wanted it to be, but it is what it is. We're here now, we're fishing it. It's not impossible. Took my chances down a bit once it got up, but I've done it before. I don't know if it's a flathead or not. It kind of ran like a blue. It's kind of rolling like a blue too. I hope it's a flathead, man. I'm out here flathead fishing. Dag blasted blue cat, man. Showing up in my flathead video and stealing my skipjack head. Dag blasted. Let me go cut another bait, man. Wrong fish. That ain't what we're after. Not unless they're over 50 pounds. Not today, not this video anyhow. I'm a paying my flathead dues. But so far all I'm getting is blues. I'll throw a bait. And sit and wait when I hear that clicker I won't hesitate cuz I'm just sitting here paying my flathead dues paying them dues people but so far all I'm getting is blues full moon I hate a full moon I like leading up to the full moon if I can fish before it gets up 
But if you get out here and it's already up, well, good luck. ISB tries to get me a cut bait flathead. It's just about dark, man. Hoping that'll spark just a little bite from them. The getting dark thing, you know, it works sometimes. I ain't even put no banjo music in this video. If I get a flathead, I'll go ahead and play some banjo music, maybe. I could try walking up to my truck. Seems like you always get a bite when you walk away from your rods. Let me try that. Well, that didn't work. Come on, flathead, I ain't got long. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Come on, Mr. Flathead. I gots to go to bed. I can't stay out all night. I gots to be up before daylight. That full moon is high in the sky. Well, I done talk the talk, now I can't walk the walk. I'd like to stay here all night, since I talked all that hype. Old Flathead's let me down, now I look like a clown. Talking all that smack, here I am and I ain't caught jack. But this is how you do it, people, this is how I roll. You do it all you can when fishing's in your soul. Come out here tonight, paying my flathead dues. Got one bite, it was a stinking old blue. Dag blasted. He don't bite soon, man. This is gonna have to be one of them Tuesday videos. All right, people. Unfortunately, I have to work for a living. It's about nine o'clock. By the time I pack up out of here, it'll be 10.30 before I get home. So, I got a little experience but I ain't magic. I'm simply paying my dues. Y'all seen me get plenty of good flatheads, and this is how I do it. I come out to flathead prone areas key times of year with certain tactics. Right now that tactic is cut bait. Throwing out in the deepest part of this thing, we're still in 50 degree water temperatures. You know, once it starts getting up in the 60s, live baits will start popping, especially close to the bank. It is a video. There was a fish in the video, even if it was the wrong fish. This is Catfish Dave with another one, signing out.